What's going on YouTube? This is NecroStevo and today's Mega Pokemon Overview is Mega Camerupt. Mega Camerupt received some interesting new tools. Of course it remains a fire ground type. It gets a new ability in the form of Sheer Force which of course gives a life orb boost to any move that has a secondary effect. But of course you no longer receive that secondary effect. So that's going to mean things like Fire Blast and Flamethrower. Lava Plume, they can no longer burn, but they're 30% more powerful. Things like Earth Power and Flash Cannon can no longer drop your opponent's special defense, but again, they get the Life Orb boost. Um, that's kind of a double-edged sword. Mega Camera can really kind of use the burn chance on a lot of things, but we'll get into that a little bit later. The stat spread on Mega Camera is very interesting, of course. It basically lost almost all of its speed in return for having higher defenses and much higher special attack. An attack of base 120 and a special attack of 145 is incredibly useful. That's very, very powerful and allows it to run some mix sets very effectively. Unfortunately, with, even with its defenses being excellent, defense 100, special defense 105, and the HP being at 70, it just has so many common weaknesses, specifically to water and ground, that it really won't get a chance to work those defenses out very much without some heavy team support. Also, it's slow, so it will be taking hits. Even though Mega Camera Up can force switches, it doesn't really matter when you're that slow, unless you're using it on a Trick Room team. Speaking of Trick Room, that's probably the main type of um, usage I can see for Mega Camera Up is on a Trick Room team. Uh, with the base speed of 20, you can run a minus speed nature and very easily run a mix set. Uh, even without, wow, there was a very loud beep outside. I guess that was just someone beeping in agreement. Even without the Trick Room, though, you can still run a Mix Sweeper because he just has the move pool for it and have some relative success, especially if you have some wish support on the team. One of my favorite sets uh, back in 5th gen, of course, was just a Choice Spec Camera. So a special wall breaker that just focuses all on special attack and just blasting through the opponent's team, just blowing holes in it, is also going to be an effective set Although I do think it will be less popular because Mega Camera Up does not have a great move pool unless you take into account both physical and special attacks. Generally, you're going to see Earth Power, a Fire Move, and maybe Rock Slide or Flash Cannon. Um, the Fire Move will vary between Flamethrower and Fire Blast depending on uh, the KOs you're, um, you want to net or if you just like accuracy, of course, over power. With Flamethrower getting the 30% power boost from Sheer Force. I can see a lot of people opting for it over Fire Blast because missing sucks. Um, it also gets Heat Wave from the Move Tutor, so that is kind of the middle ground as far as that's concerned. Now Explosion and Eruption are both worth mentioning just because they are very powerful moves. Um, eruption, especially on a Trick Room set, can really punch some holes into some teams off that 145 base attack, special attack rather. And Explosion, just being a powerful move generally. Um, especially when Camera Rupt is down on its last couple legs, you don't have any way to get its HP back. That can be worth consideration as well. Now, as far as checks and counters go, water moves generally going to be the best way to stop Camera Rupt. It's four times weak to them, and it's very slow. Scald and Surf are very, very popular moves in the current metagame. Uh, and generally, the things using the water moves are going to be faster than Camera Rupt. The only thing that might be slower or if Camera for some reason isn't running a, a minus speed nature and it's facing against something like a Gastrodon that is. Um, balloon Heatran is also worth mentioning because against Balloon Heatran, Camera Up is basically relegated to using something like Rock Slide or Flash Cannon just to pop the balloon. Meanwhile, Heatran can use its own Earth Power against Camera Up or set up rocks, that type of thing. Um, Sun is worth mentioning to run with Mega Camera Up just because it powers up its moves so much and of course it cuts in half that water weakness down to um, just a two times effectiveness. But conversely, rain is very powerful against Mega Camera Up as it makes it take even more damage from water attacks to kind of an obscene extent. And of course, it gets uh, rid of the power of its main draw, which is the fire moves that it's using. That being said, since its defenses are so high, running some screens alongside it, or even um, just running nine tails with sun support can really help um, its longevity. Uh, and if you don't want to run that, just running a Pokemon with Storm Grain or Water Absorb, such as Gastrodon uh, 
or water absorb maybe man time um, things like that might be able to, to to partner up with Mega Camera in a way to deter your opponent from wanting to use water moves. Granted, those types of Pokemon are popular anyway, just because water moves are so popular. So, what do you guys think of Mega Camera Up? Be sure to leave what you think in the comments and look forward to the next Mega Pokemon later this week. I'll talk to you guys later. Bye bye.